Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? Welcome to my new playlist which I call My Build Status. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. So, first things first, my build status. What is this playlist gonna be? Many of you know that I play only one character, I don't have mule characters, and many of you requested for me to make some sort of uh, build videos. Well, the thing is, I am a sort of limited in time in terms of full-time job, plus I became a father on the 20th of May 2019, so less than three weeks ago, and my time has been limited to play, right? So I can't even figure, actually now I did figure out what is my main build going to be like, and it's going to be Commando That's Build, right? So in this video, like in these video playlists, I'll be uh, making updates of my only one character build and uh, plus if you could recommend me something that I can add on or can be more beneficial to the character I'll be only big thankful right so let's take a look at the moment uh, what we have now so uh, my character is almost level 300 yeah it's 298 so my effects is uh, well I do have uh, adrenaline I mean mutations all of these mutations I've bought but I'm thinking of getting rid of them and uh, I'll mention why a little bit later in the video but overall uh, I have the uh, adrenal reaction which gives more uh, weapon damage uh, the lower my health is and plus the negative effect is m um, minus health uh, bird bones plus agility which is really good strength don't care about it to be honest so I was cool with it and reduce false uh, this thing right here basically helps me to eat food and get more uh, benefits out of it so I don't have to uh, eat a lot of food. I already got rid of my mutations previously and this was a <laughs> losing this one was a real pain including the marsupial which uh, gives more carry weight and the jump height, the superman jump, many of you know it. Uh, the eagle eyes are is a really good for my build because it gives more perception which means more accuracy in vats plus 25% uh, critical damage and, well, minus one strength, so it's so-so. Uh, the healing factor, plus 300% uh, regen of health only when you're not in combat, and uh, minus 13% from chem effects. Uh, scaly skin, damage resistance to, uh, well, damage resistance and energy resistance plus 50, but minus AP, and which is 12, which is not that super high. Uh, because of the perk card which actually lowers the negative effects by 75%. I'll get into that in, in a bit once I'm going to be showing you my perk cards. And Demon Speed is one of my favorite. The Reload, the Movement Speed, uh, Thirst hun Hunger uh, plus 50% while moving. <laughs> uh, this, this I'm not quite following. I actually forgot what exactly. I think I get more hungrier and thirstier while moving I guess. So uh, that's what I have from the mutations plus uh, I do take a lot of benefits from alcohol. Right now, as you can see, my character is alcohol addicted. <laughs> but I get tripled the results, plus I get more luck when I drink alcohol. Uh, I'll get into that part also once I start covering the perk cards. So my specials, uh, 20 strength, uh, perception 34. So my main key uh, stats and specials is perception agility and luck I unfortunately I had to lower my agility and right now it's charisma more I'll explain why because uh, at the moment uh, I've switched my build into more of PvE than PvP and I'll get to that in a second as well <laughs> oh man endurance is one <laughs> yeah I can get one shot at easy uh, but that's not a big problem and uh, collections, oh, collections is my current caps and legendary scripts. Okay, so let's uh, navigate to my guns. The guns that I use. My favorite gun now, from now on is this one right here. Heart Penetration Wife. Uh, gives 15% uh, more faster reload, 33% uh, that's hit chance, and uh, AA, so uh, armor penetration. Uh, it's a really good one. 
<laughs> I like it. But instead of 15%, I would really love to get like minus 25% from AP usage. Now, that would be just freaking beautiful. Like what I'm looking like for my main main gun that I really, really, really want to find now, because I know where I'm going to, finally, because I was thinking switching to melee build, I was th thinking to make a sniper, which didn't work out, so I switched back to commando yesterday. And I ended up wasting a lot of uh, skill points, which is ridiculous, to be honest. And plus, right now on my level, it's really hard to level up. So, uh, let's go. So, I would love to get uh, minus 25% or 20%. Uh, wait, I have it written down somewhere. Oh, yeah, there we go. Minus 25% uh, less VATS action points cost. That would be just... Mwah. And uh, overall... Uh, the handmade rifle on its own drains way less uh, AP if it's automatic. So even if my uh, I lowered my agility, I can still use VATS and really good. So right now, this is my favorite gun. Uh, secondary for close combat and no VATS, I will use the explosive wife. <laughs> uh, bullets explode for the area damage, shoots uh, an additional projectile. So it's like two shot plus bullet explode. Uh, I got this gun for, uh, it was gifted to me, I'll put it this way. I was l under level 70, I believe. I, I don't remember. I had this gun for decades until I looted uh, this baby right here. I think like three or, no, actually a month ago, something like that. And it became just my, my holy grail for now. First of all, I don't kill myself because, you know, the bullet explode. If you shoot up close with my health, boom. <laughs> and I'm screwed pretty much <laughs> so uh, these are my two favorite guns uh, this one used to be one of the favorites I called her the soul penetration wife but now I'm selling her <laughs> uh, it's a good gun so you get 50% more damage in vats 90% weight reduction and ignores 50% of your targets armor so I might I don't know, I'm not even going to keep it 140%, 140 damage, but I don't have any rifle perk cards anymore. I replaced it with Commando. I'll get to the perk cards in a sec. Now, in terms of armor, the th my armor is super old, because <laughs> I didn't know exactly what I wanted. But after a few thinking, because I did gather your feedback, right? So I sort of finally made up my mind of what I want. It's definitely unwielding is uh, one of the effects is a must-have. Uh, the second must-have is AP uh, regen. So it's uh, increased action point, refresh speed. That's what I want. Uh, but if I cannot get that one, agility, luck, or perception will work for me. Uh, well, I wrote down agility and luck. I'm not sure if you can get perception. But I'm pretty sure you can. And uh, for the third effect that I would 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 want is become harder to detect while sneaking. It's sort of okay. Uh, food, drink, camps, weight less. I haven't actually uh, decided what I really want over there. <laughs> it's a hard call over there, to be honest. But that's what I'm sort of looking at. But I think become harder to detect while sneaking is going to be the best one. But as I said, for my commando build, sneak is not going to be the number one priority. But having that is already a good addition to my to my build. So if you have any recommendations on what do you think would, should be the perfect third effect, uh, combining the unwielding and the action point uh, regen, I will thank you so much. <laughs> and obviously explain why. <laughs> Uh, so I think Z Clan, we're gonna build my build together. <laughs> so uh, let me quickly show you what I'm using here. I used to use this for PvP, so it sort of makes me invisible, and it's a really good one. But I think it's broken, to be honest, because I have been killed. Like I wasn't even engaging in combat; I was just taking a look on how the dudes were PvPing, and then over a sudden, I get a freaking headshot without moving, without having my gun aimed. I like put it away I shouldn't be like and I still got killed so I actually have a big feeling that there are a lot of cheaters over there and I'm not talking about the spam uh, stim pack spam that you, you should target and the thing that does not freaking die when it has one HP and you shoot and you shoot and you shoot and you shoot and he's not dying <laughs> uh, some of you guys said it's a server glitch uh, some of you said it's a stim pack 
sort of glitch or whatever. I don't get it. But uh, there was a player, I mean, there is a Z member, J Jason, who pointed out that there are a actually cheats that you can download. And you can get, like, Superman Jump, see invisible people, uh, be not able to be fast. And that is, like, what the... Seriously. Because I have encountered that trezillions of times. The target is right in front of me. It's standing. It's not sneaking, it's standing. It's visible, and it's not using a stealth boy. And I was clicking VATS, 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 and it's not VATS to him. What the hell? I also had cases when I was taking the, oh, like, there was a party of dudes, like, two on one. Uh, I took them on one, once, no problem. Took them out the second time, no problem. Then, VATS stopped working, and they take me out, like, as if... Nothing matters, like, nothing happened, like, I am really bad, over, over a sudden, my skill just, <laughs> down, you know, and I was thinking, like, come on, this is actually one of the reasons I decided to pause P survival mode, just because of uh, this issue, I would say. I'm not claiming that there are cheaters, I think there are, and I'm pretty sure there are, but I'm not stating that. What do you think, are there any cheaters? Just out of curiosity. Want to hear your thoughts on the survival mode. Uh, honestly, Bethesda needs to work on that. That is 100%. So. Uh, my armor. So this is what I have. One of my favorites. Then I got this one right here. Strength, you see. This one I was running with it since for decades. As you can see, it's level 40. <laughs> it's a bad one. And, uh, man... That is just insane. And by the way, the unwielding is the one that makes me having so many stats buffs, just in case if you uh, don't know. It gives more um, plus three to all stats the lower your health is, right? So it can give you plus one, it can give you plus two, and it can give you plus three. So the lower your health, you get plus three, but not HP. So have that in mind. And this one right here. So. This one I actually looted recently. It's a pretty good one. I might be selling this one, by the way. <laughs> or I'm going to be using it until I find what I want to replace it with. Because it does have this, uh, while you're not moving, 15% more defense. But, I don't know. With a commando playstyle, I think I'll be running a lot. So, I don't know. I want to hear your recommendations here. <laughs> But I did have cases when I was shooting the target, and the target, like, it was just sitting there, not moving, and barely taking damage. And, uh, first of all, probably he had the entire set of the sen Sentio, that's how it's called if I'm not mistaken. Plus, he had the good cards in his adherence that, uh, because at that time I was using explosives only. I didn't have my heart penetration wife. Uh, so... So he had the fireproof or whatever it's called. I, I don't remember right now. We'll get to the cards in a second. Alright, so that's pretty much it. And uh, let's navigate to the cards. <clears throat> so, at the moment, this is my PvE build. Uh, when I'm going to be tr switching to the PvP build, most of my charisma will be gone. And it will be given to the agility plus... Charisma will be lowered to 1, and I'll increase my... Uh, I don't know what I'm going to increase. I haven't th thought about the PvP. Now, right now, we're talking about my current set. What the... Why do I have the super duper thing here? Weird. I thought I... Oh, now I get it why my uh, attack was low. Lol. <laughs> mm, let me see if I have everything. Yeah. So, this is what I pretty much use. Uh, for strength, it's just extra to carry weight. As you can see, my strength is 1, and it's been 1 since beta. So I sh actually, I deleted my character on the first week of beta and replaced it because at that time we couldn't redo the specials, and I really messed up during the beta with my specials. So, I didn't know that they would bring the uh, ability to switch specials so quickly. So, thank you, Bethesda. Should have notified us up front. <laughs> so my perception is all maxed out and obviously uh, commando is in use everywhere maxed out the tank killer so it's sort of that uh, uh, armor penetration 
your rifles, right? And the final one is concentrated fire rate. So this really helps with my current build to uh, initiate head headshots all the time. So I get to kill enemies really quick. For Edrance, since it's uh, just one, I use the uh, Radical because uh, the greater your reds, the greater strength. <laughs> so basically, since I'm always in radiation, as you can see, uh, I was asked that question many times on the streams. Why don't you clear your radiation? <laughs> You're about to die and many other comments in this area. So this gives me more strength <clears throat> and that is cool. A good addition. I didn't I don't think there's anything better. But obviously <clears throat> the good thing is the fireproof against all of those bullet explosive dudes and uh, also someone recommend me to take a look at this, oh, I, I don't think I have it. Crap. I think it was the skeleton or something. But, oh, nope, stop. Eh, 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 let's quickly find him. Nyo, 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 nyo. Nyo, nyo, nyo. Uh, okay, let's not waste time on this. <laughs> I'm, I, I haven't used that evidence. These two were always, like, the lowest I ever had. You, I play around with perception, charisma, intelligence, agility, and luck. So at the moment, since this is my PVE character, I use the Party Boy, and uh, combine it with Happy Go Lucky. So basically, Party Boy, uh, the effects of uh, alcohol are tripled. So for example, if a pint of beer gives me one strength, now it gives me three strength. Well. Usually it's strength and something else. I'm trying to find my perfect alcohol that I'll be consuming. Uh, at the moment, I stopped with uh, Pickaxe Pilsner because it gives charisma and it gives strength. Uh, so charisma affects the uh, the ability to lead and help and uh, share your per uh, share uh, your cards with your teammates and also get good re uh, prices from quests. Uh, and better prices when you trade. So better prices when you trade, that's why I maxed out my charisma. Right now my goal is to uh, buy all possible plants, all possible recipes, everything possible from vendors. And trust me, that is a lot of money. <laughs> Which comes to me only by selling some legendaries on Market76. On Market76, I only sell, I don't buy. Because I'm afraid that the item that you can buy can be duped and I have a feeling that at some point I hope I'm wrong uh, but I have a feeling that at some point uh, all the duped items are gonna be removed so that's why I don't want to risk it and I keep it like I use whatever I find <laughs> so that's pretty much my logic the only item that I did not loot as I said uh, was the bullet explode wife and as I said it was gifted to me uh, and I explained that in my uh, how to get mods quickly for weapons uh, guide video uh, the entire case overall I just helped out the guy we were trading blah 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 and I told him hey man uh, I saw he has this AK what do you want for it I'll give you everything all my junk all my caps everything just take it all and just give me that thing he's like no it's alright man I'll give it to you for free uh, because before that I, w I wanted to give I gave him a whole bunch of plans and other stuff so I don't remember because remember, that was like months and months ago. So let's get back to the cards. <clears throat> so, uh, Lone Wanderer, that's when uh, I'm solo playing. At the moment, I'm solo playing a lot. Previously, I used to play in, in teams a lot. Ooh, what is this doing here? I shouldn't be there. So, Suppressor, uh, Travel Agent, obviously, to save caps. Suppressor, and uh, in my solo play, I use this card right here. Uh, so make your target receive 7% more damage for 10 seconds after your attack. So even more damage. Bam, 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 bam. You going down, boy. Uh, if if it happens that I'm going to survival, I usually turn pretty much all the time turned on the uh, inspirational to get even more XP because on survival mode you get 20% plus these 15%. You get already that's 35%. If you sleep, that's another 5%. That's 40%. And man. And remember those uh, double XP weekends? Uh, you could have gotten. I leveled up like crazy on those days. <laughs> With combination of all this, plus you combine food. I have uh, the food guide video in my mind. I just want to learn it more. 
uh, same goes for the alcohol I just don't have the time unfortunately to work on that I have so many ideas in my head but the time is just stopping me of doing things that I want to do plus sometimes I've noticed that whenever I was doing videos I made mistakes so let's hope I will not be making those mistakes uh, when I'm uh, playing with a company like with players right I usually remove all these cards and I use this one to increase more uh, charisma to get more benefits then I would use um, ah, I would definitely use this one because it's mutations and other stuff I would still use this one because I need more levels I lost 15 lo well I took off all of the agility and uh, I mean I had over 30 uh, perk points but I'm saving those right now for my future update into PvP uh, when I'll have more time to play <laughs> and I'm planning to make PvP montages in the future as well uh, then what else am I using? I am using I think bodyguards actually yeah, yeah hold on a second oh no 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 my bad that's not that's not it I use this one so this is my set when I'm playing with someone on board and I try to make my party of four people so full party to get even more benefits and it really helps me to have the inspirational per card if I invite somebody who I do not know uh, or we talk on a video on voice or he's low level I'm explaining it to him that I'm gonna share this card with him and he's gonna get 15% more XP uh, so that's kinda cool and it really helps to find people to play with and uh, you can you don't have to run together uh, so we can split up and we all still get more benefits out of being a part of a team right but in, in some cases like uh, if you have a full team of fully equipped it with all weapons and other stuff right and you know you're not going to fight someone like PvP or whatever uh, the best solution for you guys is to split up because uh, you can kill enemies really quick right and uh, your teammates will not benefit from you killing an enemy if he didn't shoot it uh, basically he doesn't get the XP he doesn't even get the loot if he didn't shoot the uh, mob that you killed and I find that a little bit kinda like messed up I would really want Bethesda if you're watching to improve like change it uh, how about like make the group receive less XP but even if you didn't shoot the enemy so he gets the XP as well right that's that's gonna be fair uh, plus the loot let him get the loot as well even if he didn't shoot the, the damn thing because you, you're still part of the team because right now uh, when I'm playing with someone is I, I would recommend to split up because the splitting up we share what we want to do and we just do our own stuff with more benefits so that's what I sort of do right now so uh, gunsmith combined with this thing right here is heaven on earth uh, because ever since I started using this combination of cards I forgot when the last time I repaired my weapon I'm not lying I didn't repair my weapon for weeks <laughs> try it <laughs> you'll see the results and that's of course if you have very very high luck because this thing for me triggers pretty much all the time uh, this thing uh, helps like it helps the gun not to break so I increase the chances of this thing popping and repairing my gun so these two combinations is like it really helps you uh, not to fix your weapon if you go back into my live streams because I do have a playlist of that uh, and see me in PvP mode I wasn't using these two cards and I used to fix my weapon like every freaking 10 minutes it was so freaking annoying yeah I couldn't even like explain it was annoying like you bam 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 come on man <laughs> and uh, nerd rage obviously while uh, below 20 well 20 percent health you gain more damage resistance that's whatever I'm I'm here for the damage for the 20 percent damage and 15 percent AP regen this is what I like but the the others are just a slight bonus for me <laughs> now uh, agility gun fu just one star and uh, AP regen. AP regen obviously makes sense so my AP points uh, like 
recover quicker with this per card it's 30% combined with this that's uh, already 45% plus if I'm soloing and I have my uh, low vent this guy right here that's 30% and uh, 30 45 and uh, 75% which is freaking good so yeah <laughs> that's pretty much how it is uh, in PvP I used to have my agility maxed out <laughs> now in terms of luck I have the Grim, uh, Grim Reaper's Sprint uh, to refill my AP uh, fully it has a 35% so uh, because right now I lowered my agility and actually this is a really good card turns out I thought it was crap but in reality it's a really good thing it's like uh, when you shoot shoot because uh, gun fu allows you to uh, while that's if you're shooting a target the target dies and there's another target right next to it it will automatically switch to another target if there's another one to another to another as long as you have AP to shoot right so as, soon, as long as soon as you uh, run out of AP that's it you are thrown out of vats because you don't have but this thing with this thing it happens you shoot you shoot you shoot you shoot your AP is low you shoot and that thing triggers and your AP is back again and you shoot and you shoot and you shoot and you shoot again <laughs> so you shoot pretty much all the time in VATS and that is I, I can't ex even explain how OP this is uh, especially on events like um, I forgot the one how it's called in Fort Defiance when there's a whole bunch of those scores fools running around and you're like, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> so crazy uh, log draw, I already explained since this, this is PvE, I can use take advantage of this. Uh, throw a leaf, uh, clover, cleaver, clover. Sorry, I'm from Ukraine, so I sometimes mispronounce things. If you want to help me improve my pronunciation, feel free to do so in the comments. You don't hurt my feelings, I only say big thank you. Because I remember when I was doing my very, 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 very first <laughs> video about ammo, how to get ammo, how to craft it. I used to say lead when it's supposed when I should have said lead. <laughs> and I wasn't the only YouTuber who actually made this mistake, <laughs> turns out. But thanks to you, now I know it's, it's lead, it's not lead. <laughs> so this thing helps me to recharge my critical meter. I prefer to have it three stars, but due to the limitations, I, I can't. Uh, class break is the one that reduces uh, my negative uh, benefits from mutations by 75%. So I never take this card off. Never. I never take off this card, Star's Genes, because uh, you will never mutate from rats. That's one. I don't get any more uh, mutations, even if I get radiated right now. Uh, and when I use uh, stuff to clear my uh, radiation, what was it? Right away? Yeah, right away. Uh, if you don't have this card and you have your mutations and you use right away, you will lose part of your uh, mutations or whatever cures your, you will lose them. So this thing never leaves now because all the mutations that I have that I've shown you, I bought them on the, uh, actually a friend of mine found a good vendor who sold it to us for 450 caps per mutation. So that was a pretty good deal. Uh, right now on the market, I mean previously on the market 76 when I wanted to buy the mutations they would go like oh, 2k like, What for one mutation 2k hell no <laughs> come on give me a break so and the final way wait, 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 wait. I Have something wrong here now. I get why I'm dying Jesus Christ Now I know why I was dying I had the wrong thing. Actually, bloody mess is one of the good stuff, but I use. Wait, Johnny woke up. I use this one. Oh my god! I can't believe it. I messed up my own build. <laughs> uh, so this is what I use. While below level 30 health, you gain 45% chance to avoid damage. That means all of the damage. Remember, on many of my videos, I have. Uh, a clip at the very end of the video when I jump off the monorail and I land and I didn't die that's because this thing uh, triggered <laughs> that's why I like basically all of that damage that I took from falling uh, this 
Serendipity. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Please let me know in the comments if I did, so I don't make mistakes in future. Uh, absorbed all of that damage. So this is also a must-have if you're playing low HP. Uh, usually I also use this other avoid damage, but I don't have a perfect idea how it really works. I mean, avoid 30 uh, of incoming, 30% of incoming damage at the cost of 30. Ah, okay. So it's 30. Thir okay, okay, now I think I get it now. I thought it helps you to dodge or something. Now pretty much like if you get 100 damage, uh, instead of getting 100, you get 70. I hope I, I understood that correctly. Over 30%. Of incoming damage to the cost of your or maybe avoid all of the damage I think all of the damage would you point out because if if avoid all of the damage this could be pretty good actually really good so if you know how this dodgy card works like you know for a hundred hundred percent let me know and I think I can find good use for it in my future PvP build so, those are my cards, and I think there's nothing else to show you. I think I covered it all, huh? Didn't I? Yes, sir, I did. So, I covered my guns, I covered my current appeal. So, yeah, I covered everything. So, folks, you know the drill. Don't forget to leave that. Oh, you. <laughs> That's of course if you enjoyed the show. Now the other thing is um, these this playlist is gonna be dedicated to this one character. I'm not gonna be creating mules. I'm not gonna be creating second characters. I'm not gonna be creating none of that uh, because I barely have time just to play one one character. So, and many of you wanted the <clears throat> uh, build video. There you go. I made it a little bit different approach. I had the build videos in mind. If I only had more time, I could have done some specific builds. But I wanted to do it full, like full build, like with having all of the armor that you need, with having all of the weapons that you need, and other stuff. Those videos, not all, and not something like I have the perk cards, I have the mutations, but I don't have the weapons and I don't have the armor. And then I'm gonna be telling you, okay, guys, listen up. Now, uh, having this weapon and having this armor, this build that I just shown you will be just freaking off the hook. <laughs> I want to show everything by example and you know since I'm playing just one guy you can see my streams how it how OP it is and I'm pretty sure a lot of Zeke clan members will tell you that my build was OP in PvP and other stuff it was really freaking insane especially Commando Commando I'm in love with Commando <laughs> Eden me and you commando boys for life <laughs> all right so i hope you enjoyed the video and uh please do leave your comments down below please do if you possible answer the question that i've uh asked you throughout this video if you have an answer to them feel free to ask questions and neither i or one of the z members will be able to respond because uh that's the way i run the channel <laughs> i try to make sure that there's engagement happening in the comment section uh, between me and you, you and you. <laughs> well, Z client supports everyone, <laughs> including me. <laughs> you, you, yeah, Z client, I love you. It's like the amount of support you give me is just, uh, I don't know. I, I can't find the words. Like, priceless, can't buy, uh, like, the best thing that ever happened to me I'll put it this way <laughs> so I appreciate all of your support so now I think we can call it a day because I've been talking too much so folks you have a good morning day and night whatever you guys lock it at and I'll see you on the next video and by the way if you subscribed welcome to Z clan if you want to help my channel grow please do consider sharing this video somewhere in the media such as uh, Twitter or Facebook or any other platform or save it to your YouTube playlist that you save your videos to <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Да. Brother, братан, лови меня. Я готов тебя спасать. Rock and roll, baby. Woo! Assassin. Oh, this is gonna hurt. What?
Ay, su madre. I survived. I jumped out of that thing, I survived. What? Ты почему не умер? Сработал этот, короче. Oh my god.